Hello everyone, Crystal Fisher here. Welcome to another Spyro 3 video. It's not a glitch, I mean, it is a glitch video, sorry. It's not a Let's Play part, but Let's Play parts will be returning soon. Anyway, I thought it'd be cool to show you a really cool glitch in Spyro 3, where basically you jump onto this tree. Yep, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. No, just kidding. What it actually is, is it's a little masterful thing over here. You jump over here after you get to the tree. Now, firstly, when you do that uh, glide over there, you've got to basically be pointing the arrow like down, you know, down to go up, you know, that kind of thing to try and get, you know, get to the top, right? Um, so then you basically have just enough uh, of, of a hover ability to get to the tree and then you go out over here which happens to be a uh, solid ground so uh, insomniac knew we'd be able to do this glitch not not really but you know it's cool that they made they solidified this ground even if they didn't we'd still be able to do it because what we're going to be doing is we're going to be gliding or we're going to be head bashing the water to do a really awesome glitch now just load a save state we're going to what we're going to do is go down here like that and then head bash see now it's actually, you gotta get it really well timed. That was very, very, uh, quite a lot of luck on my behalf. Um, but all right. Basically now we are swimming in the air. Look at that. We're swimming in the air. Now it doesn't make much sense, but uh, because basically it gets mixed up as being both in the water, but uh, also, you know, on, in the ground, it basically gives you, it acts as if the pool of water is the entire area and there's no cancel except when you land back into normal swimming waiting. Now, because there's no um, actual swimming, you know, proper pools in this level, except for, you know, shallow, um, basically, yeah, you, the easy way to get back in is to just go back into the water. But now, We've basically tricked the game into believing that uh, we're in the water now up here you'll see that we won't get back into it because this isn't actually a water it's just a texture a flowing texture but as soon as we were to get back into there it would be now um, this is a really cool little glitch it just allows you to kind of i don't know explore the really small level it's better for bigger levels just because it's awesome you can find secret shit or something but um but for this one it's pretty simple uh, now, oh yeah no there is a pool of water in here of course there is yeah my bad um but it's over there so it's pretty much irrelevant now you can see the castle very nice you can uh Go wherever you want. Look at that. It's fantastic. You can actually, now if let's say that level wasn't open, what you can do is you go under here, right? You go over over, over the uh, little hill here and then down. And basically, if you were to get to about this point here, that's where the portal's hidden. Um, now, in terms of uh, the extra Crystal Vision channel, I thought it'd be good to upload a video just to commentate for the lack of Spyro 3 recently, um, but also to kind of give an update because two LPs have finished since my last update. Um, that being Rash and Clank to the Nexus and Crash Nitro Kart. So, I thought it'd be a good time to announce that your yeah, Spyro 3 will obviously continue, so will Crash 3, and I'll probably start an Ape Escape retrospective very soon. Um, how's about that, guys? Um, I'm excited for that. Now, um, look at this. It's just it's just a cool glitch, and I really want to get that thing where you're able to, um, like, with the XX Battles Pro Gamers XX, he's working on a thing where you can replace the skybox i want to change the skybox to be like a different color i want it to be like a you know can you imagine this level looking like on the fireworks factory with the tech with the skybox up here that'd be fantastic but yeah, anyway from uh, the crystal vision front i'm planning on releasing a new music album soon as well um, and maybe charging eight dollars for the release but giving a Bandcamp promo code to basically if you buy it for eight you get another like one of the older albums you know for free you know that, that as a kind of a gimmick to try and sell it more not that i'm trying to be like a money growing bastard but mainly just because I think that you know at the end of the day I think it would be cool to could have put a bit of a price tag and people who really do appreciate the music to um, you know purchase it because uh, you know just like everyone else you know you gotta you gotta make the dosh somehow but um, obviously people don't want it that's perfectly fine but it's just something I want to put out there to see see how many people do care about uh, the music uh, the track in the background right now is one of my tracks I was just working on uh, the album should be pretty good it should probably clock in at almost an hour I think so I think getting your money's worth really um, if you were to buy like one of the other albums it basically you get eight dollars for almost two hours worth of content so yeah that's cool so uh, yeah just a bit of a plug there um, of course I love doing Spyro glitches and if I can remember any more I can do any more I'll definitely upload them but uh, over my time on YouTube I have been doing I've done quite a lot of glitch videos over the years so you know of course this is no different but anyway hope you enjoyed it and uh, you get to hopefully you didn't know how to do that 
So, um, you know, it's kind of a cool surprise. I bet a lot of you would know, but uh, for the people that didn't, enjoy. And uh, in the next uh, Spyro 3 video you're going to see me doing, it will be properly. Um, I'm going to start like this, ready? I'm going to start, I'm going to save set it here, and uh, you, you guys can wonder what's going on after. Um, I'll start here in the next part of the Spyro Let's Play, which this, even though this isn't a Let's Play, we'll be going to Seashell Shore. So, see you then. Thank you very much for watching.